It's pretty easy to get a student loan. Just fill out your forms online and request the amount you need from your school's financial aid office. You kind of just sign the papers and like put it out of your mind till the end because you know it's like going to be this large number, but you just you don't see it. But that's only until six months after you graduate, because that's when the debt becomes a reality and your payments start. You, you know, after your grace period's over and it goes back into repayment, and you're like, oh crap. <laughs> You have like this huge number you have to start worrying about. Right now, more than 36 million Americans have student loan debts, and President Obama is trying to relieve the pressure. Last year, he encouraged Congress to pass a new repayment plan to reduce monthly interest rates. And let's tell another one million students that when they graduate, they will be required to pay only 10 percent of their income on student loans and all of their debt will be forgiven after 20 years. That plan starts in 2014 and it's income based, meaning if you don't make a lot of money, your interest rate is lower. But the president wants to implement the plan next year. So he's bypassing Congress and taking executive action to do just that. This new student loan repayment plan could drastically change your monthly expenses. Say you're a nurse right now with about $60,000 in student loan debt, but you only make about $45,000 a year. Well, under the current system, you pay about $690 a month. Once this new plan goes into effect, that drops down to about $250. That's a savings of $450 a month, or over $5,000 a year. You just pay it off and kind of forget about it till the next payment. It's kind of like something that becomes part of like what you have to do. Paying loans is a part of life, but this new plan may make life just a little bit easier. 